Hey guys, it's John from John's DIY Playground. Today we're out camping just north of Port Huron. And you can see I've got a couple of uh, telescoping flagpoles up in the air. One has our stars and stripes and the Polish flag. The other has a modem and repeater slash hotspot that I'm going to talk to you guys about today. So let's get started. We're just behind the propane tanks in front of my rig here, and this is the battery box. Um, there's a 3 amp fuse in this fuse holder, and these are Anderson power poles that I use as the connector of the 12 volts that runs up the pole and connects to our repeater up top. To connect and disconnect, it's very easy. You can just pull the terminals, and it's hard with one hand, but they lock together and they just snap in place quickly and easily. The telescoping flagpole is from Harbor Freight and it collapses down into several sections as you can see here. Um, on the left is the repeater. It's made by Pep Wave. It's the BR Max 1, BR1. This is a directional cellular antenna. So I point it due west here at this park away from Canada, away from Lake Huron to get good cell signal. The BR1 will take the cell signal, transmit it into a Wi-Fi signal, it becomes my hotspot. So here you can see the PEP wave, how it's connected. The two white wires are for the antenna to the cellular. The black one is for the Wi-Fi. And this other end is the other Anderson power pole that gives it the 12 volts, feeds on the other side. And this lower part of the case just slides in and feeds the upper part of the case and there's holes at the top that are protected from the rain um, so the heat can come out through the top but it's protected from the elements. This is the business end um, that gives you status lights. It's usually facing upwards. There's some LAN ports that I taped off. I sometimes use the DCN port uh, when I'm using it indoors um, with smaller antennas, but that's it. That's the pep wave And I hope you learned something if you did please like and give a thumbs up Also, please remember to subscribe to videos when new ones come out. This is John from John's DIY playground. Have a great day